Don't put that camera on me when I've got my hair all messed up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't had my makeup done. In your face. You seem a little tired. <laughs> I'm completely knackered. We've just done the fight scene in the, in the barn in the hay. So I've just spent about two hours rolling around in the hay, bouncing off of haystacks, rolling around, fighting, scrolling up, being kicked, punched, all sorts of things. No? What? So what happened last night? Why? What do you mean what happened last night? Why? What's all this white stuff and why are people still here? Because life is shit. Yeah, Everybody, <laughs> we're wrapped for today! Yay! Let's Boom. go home! Uh, we we, we uh, arrived on set, well, well, I woke up on set, um, to the worst snowfall that we've had in, in 18 years, I think it was. Film over. Film film over, bar, bar going out there with lots of bar heaters and melting <laughs> acres, acres, <laughs> acres of snow. How's it going? Um... <laughs> True story? <laughs> yeah. I'm um, kind of struggling at the moment. So there's a lot to get done before dawn. We're chasing light now. Thank you very much, everybody. That's cut. That's Yay! a wrap for dawn. And that is very thankfully a wrap from this location of hell. Description of Jacob and what his role in Umbridge is. Uh, Jacob is an antique dealer. And at the beginning of the film, he is bringing what he hopes will be his new happy family to his new home, farmhouse uh, in the country. But his, um, his happy family is um, a little on the dysfunctional side, to say the least of it. Uh, he is bringing with him uh, uh, Rachel, who is his stepdaughter, um, from his previous marriage, his wife having committed suicide a year ago, and his new wife, uh, Lauren, who is very heavily pregnant um, with their baby. Um, so it's not um, it's it's not mom dad and two kids standard setup really by any means. Um, and of course, little does he know that uh, he's he has other dysfunctional relationships um, about to break around his head with. Um, various um, camping trips that have gone wrong and um, uh, uh, ages old vampiric demon battle lines that, that are about to be fought uh, across his hand. It's not going well for Jacob from start to finish at all. Our generator turns up and well, long story short, at one point the engineer who was called out about midnight to try and fix this generator that hadn't been working for the last six hours or something um, said it should never have left the yard. You know, it was, it was broken the last time it went out, um, which was great. Um, so, so we we struggled through and obviously didn't finish what we wanted to finish in those two days with this with this dodgy generator. Oh, this oh, is my pants. Yeah. Rolling. Is it, say, is it saying record? Yeah. Hey Scott. Yo. So how was it doing that scene? First of all, what scene little, did you do? A little on the chilly side. But first of all, what scene did you just do? Uh, I just got my dick cho chopped off. How did that feel? Um, Enjoy it? Yeah, well, it, it was so-so, <laughs> to be honest. It took a long time kind of sitting around in my pants and for very little actual time. But, uh, yeah, well, the pants are punchy. He's commando now. <laughs> Those are the pants. Yeah, are nice. <laughs> no, 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 just commando, commando. Like a real Scotsman. Said no, that was 2 p.m. So obviously I was tucked up in bed by then, but not obviously didn't have a clue. So that was a quite a tough um, time. Um, We've got a movie to make. Don't let. She's got nothing to say anyway. Go <laughs> Come on. Not let him speak anymore. So um, bye. We're to finish some more scenes. Oh. Everyone, that's a wrap on the film. Thank you very much. Yeah. 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 Just going for it, really. It's the best way, I think. Did you enjoy it? Oh, God, it was wonderful. <laughs> <laughs> it was great fun.